The Alaska Democratic Party will use a ranked choice ballot this year to determine how many delegates each presidential candidate will receive, giving voters more power in their elections. Ranked choice voting allows you to rank your favorite candidates instead of choosing just one. To vote, you rank your favorite candidate as number one, then your second favorite as number two, and so on. If your first choice candidate has limited support, your next choice will be counted to ensure your vote is not wasted. Let's see how this will work with our candidates. After all the ballots are in, only first choices are counted. Any candidate that has at least 15% of the first choice votes will automatically earn delegates. Sam Seal and Gary Goose have more than 15%, so they'll win some delegates. If after counting all first choices, some candidates have not received 15% of the vote, the candidate with the fewest first choices is eliminated. In this case, that candidate is Hannah Halibut. Hannah Halibut is now eliminated, and the voters who chose Ms. Halibut as their favorite will have their votes count for their next choice. Most voters who preferred Hannah Halibut chose Sam Seal, Carla Caribou, and Gary Goose as their next choices, and a few chose the remaining candidates. Now, in addition to Sam Seal and Gary Goose, Carla Caribou has also reached the 15% threshold. For the final ranking, we repeat the process again. In the end, we have four candidates who received the most support from Alaska primary voters. Sam Seal is the clear favorite with 39% of the vote. Gary Goose comes in second with 26%, Carla Caribou earns 19%, and Sasha Salmon with 16%. Candidates will earn their proportional share of delegates based on the percentage that each candidate received in the final round of the total tally. Don't forget to vote! For more information, go to alaskarcv2020.org.